Darkness. So this will be tourney match. Bill Nye versus Redeemer Z. You bet. Oh, nice. Puff on Rob. All right. Here's the really, thing. Yeah. All right. Don't sleep on Bill Nye. Oh, no, no, you no. You are don't. asking exactly. to be slept on, literally. Yeah. And I for Jigglypuff, that's not a good thing. I am well aware of his edge guarding prowess. Yeah, he's, he's, a, he's, a, he's a phenomenal edge guarder, and he knows his rest setup. So, oh, uh, yeah, for sure. That being said, he doesn't always execute, so really, Redeemer just has to get a lead, be ready to punish um, rest, because, you know, he's still fighting Jigglypuff. Right. And he still has the weakness of having basically no moves that are safe on shield, and all of her ground moves being terrible except for dash attack, which is actually really awesome. Right, but that up B from Rob, it's lasting so long, that's going to present a challenge for that edge guarding. Uh, oh, yeah, exactly. Once Ro once Redeemer gets, like, substantially off stage, uh, Bill Nye is going to go to town. Oh, he is, but I mean, like, Redeemer can hang on for a long while. There we go. Than other characters, but that platform is there. It'll be exactly. able to aid him. Now oh, okay. He's lost the lead. Now, the thing is, a thing Jigglypuff has on her side is that she's actually one of the best timeout characters in the game. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She can um, just because of her phenomenal aerial mobility, yeah, she, she can, can just kind of get her. away. Exactly. But uh, kind of needs a lead to be able to do that. Ooh, the beat boop is going to kill Super... Ooh, not quite. Not great DI by Bill Nye there. Yeah, you're right. I was expecting that move is, to kill uh, That move is tricky to DI because you have to, again, for reasons... And here it is. That can... Three, four, the one wall of pain, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> a beautiful job by Bill Nye. Now, if he wants to, he c I don't think he will, but if he wants to, he could just try to time Redeemer out right now. <laughs> no. And with... Four minutes left, more than five actually. That oh no! Be it. no oh, he's no, fine. Okay. He's going across yeah. stage. That's a smart, smart option by Redeemer there. But uh, you know, Bill Nye. Now we always we have to say when you have a stock lead, you can pretty much do whatever you want, just kind of depending on the character. I don't know what Jigglypuff's uh, optimal strategy is. Again, I think the optimal uh, option is to try to time him out, honestly. But uh. Well, I mean, we we'll don't see what he opts for. It is a good option, but I feel that Bill Nye is moving in a lot, so I don't think he's going to be sitting around for four minutes. Right. And yeah, he's definitely trying to rack up the damage. He's exactly. definitely not just uh, trying to go for style or anything. Although he could potentially go for a rest setup since he has that uh, stock available. True. And the thing is, um, Jigglypuff has a handful of setups that can lead into rest, but on Rob, it's a little bit easier. It's a big body right there. It's a little easier. He's a bit heavy, yes. so he's got to wait for a bit longer time. That but shield pressure, too, because of yeah. that pound. It's so But, like, you long. see what Bill Nye's doing? He's playing very patiently. He's just always going back to the ledge when he's getting combo. He's like, I'm taking damage control here. Yeah, and he might not go be going for style, but, like, when you do have the stop lead, you definitely want to play patient. Absolutely. Sure. Because the, the other uh, opponent is the one that's pressured into getting that other stop on you. Exactly. And uh, and what Redeemer is doing with the top, um, I actually just recently learned this. When you Z-drop and re-grab the top, it actually resets its spin. Oh, wow. Uh, not from, like, the max but like from a minimum right so he can keep he, the, the top can be out indefinitely and up throw will absolutely do it at 165 <laughs> percent but uh we'll see uh it's all up to bill nine now he uh redeemer is at rest percent that is true so yeah, yeah yeah we'll see that being said unlike a lot of risky moves there's no need you should not go Chili for Plus it got this oh that, that was an opportunity but uh it would have been super risky because it was off stage mm -hmm. and even if he she, even if he got the kill if it was a star ko or a screen ko mm -hmm. uh jigglypuff might have died first anyway just a risk you gotta take. I think he might. Well, not, be. No, you don't have to take it. In fact, you actively shouldn't take it. But. He is doing a lot of uh, dash and stops. I think he might be looking for a rest setup. Well, like, no, I under understandably so, but. But I mean, like. Really, I think the best option is to time around. I don't think Bill Nye will do it, but. No, I don't. I do think that is the most optimal thing to do. He was trying to go for his own little <laughs> yeah. uh, Ape Man right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta stop saying Ape Man. Every Rob does it, but like, Ape Man, I guess, popularized it. Mm. Right. Oh yeah, that's another thing. Jigglypuff can just squat Wall of pain! Jigglypuff. No, no wall of pain. That He's being said, exactly. Oh no, Oops. the ledge got in the way. Wow. He could have punished that air dodge so well. Mm -hmm. Oh no, oh, he re-grabbed! Wow! Get the afterburner sent down. He re-grabbed the ledge. I mean, not to knock out Bill Nye, he was doing fantastic, but just that turnaround with that spike. Wow, exactly. that was a great setup there. That's the one. That's a big issue with Jigglypuff. And if you're gonna go for a re-grab like that, you can go under the stage. That's an option. Mm. But just uh, Redeemer, great awareness. He saw the re-grab. It's like I'm gonna spike you now. You're dead. Exactly. But no, phenomenal first stock by Bill Nye. I just, I think. Again, I think the optimal thing to do there is to try to time him out, but that doesn't appear to be his style. I can understand why that wouldn't be your style. It's not exactly a fun way to play, but... Well, yeah, you know. I mean, like, normally, you, uh, if you're going on stream, even, like, timeouts are, like, frowned upon on the... Yes and no. A, a close timeout is actually really high. I mean, like, if it's close, it's pretty high. <laughs> I was there uh, last Wednesday when Sparky timed out Redeemer for uh, winners, uh, winners Finals, I believe it was. Oh, well. Wow. And he was so upset, he got a 6-0 in Grand Finals on him. So, yeah, like, I remember hearing about that. Yeah, a lot of people were kind of upset. I mean, props well, to Sparky. Well, but if it was on Lilat, that's... Oh, that it was on Battlefield. Great. Okay. Well, yeah. the thing is, Sparky... The thing about Sparky is that his movement is amazing with Pikachu. Yes. So he can... If he wants to, he can just keep away as long as he has a lead. He has that option. 
All right, so in terms of stock, what do you think, uh, Bill Nice? Uh, you mean stage? Uh, uh, yeah, sorry. Uh, in terms of stock, they're stuck at two. Uh, it's part of the reason why this game's really inconsistent. You have two stocks. I'm coming from a birthday, <laughs> my nephew's birthday party. Give me some slack here. That's cool. I moved. <laughs> but uh, we're going to go. All right. So going back, running back to Smashville, why not? I don't think stage pick actually matters too much in this, uh, ex except I would imagine that uh, you want to not go to town and city. So. Um, if you're puff. Maybe Duck Hunt could cut off the, like, actually, that's, underneath the option. I would bet Redeemer Dan ban Duck Hunt, because yeah. that's Jigglypuff's best stage, because that's, like, the easiest stage for time people out on. Ah, okay. A lot of high platforms to escape, too. Okay. Pretty Did someone mess with the stream? I feel like we got this song last time. <laughs> oh, man, I love when this happens. All right, good down tilt. Mm, a lot more even this time around. Yeah, well, dead even. So. Oh, yeah. All right, good Nair. And, uh, yeah, Redeemer's playing a lot more just Ooh, close to the stage. Gotta be careful, gotta be careful. He oh, no. Oh, man, he's got to get nope. back. Yeah. Okay, touch the ground. He's playing a lot more uh, close to the main stage. He doesn't want to get that uh, three forwarders again off to the side like normal. But yeah, the wall of pain. It's pain Which, of course, in Melee was three back airs in this game. is three forward airs, but right. it's a wall of pain nonetheless. Ba uh, Jigger Post back air still does pretty good, too. It is. The one problem with it is that it's only active for one frame. So the hitbox is actually kind of finicky to hit with, but other than that, it's really good. It's like her only safe move on shield, I think. Wow. It's also a move that... Actually, now you should really go for it as much as possible, honestly. And he's also... Granted, in melee, it was a godlike move, but... <laughs> in this move, the game is a bit more balanced. And, uh, yeah, the up smash will just do it. <laughs> That's a fast move. Yeah, didn't get the gyro setup you wanted, but... He, he didn't have to. Yeah, he, 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 he The point is, he baited, he baited a roll off the ledge. He finished oh, it up. Here goes the are we gonna... pain, gets the re Ooh, the nice! I love that option. Oh, oh missed the tech. No tech! But no, I don't think he's... he's got, he lost oh, all his jumps. Oh, wow! He ends it in style, okay. but, like... Props to him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, he, uh... Kind of botches. Well, he doesn't. No, he, he, the edge guard was quite successful, but he, he, the, with the stock lead, that would have been fine. But yeah, that was he, unfortunate. He did get the, or no, he back aired the. Gyro. If you're gonna go out, go out in style. <laughs> That's what I was like. To say. He was trying to go for the gyro snipe, mm -hmm. but even with Rob's recovery, that wouldn't.